Hey guys, I would like to uh, have a quick discussion about this um, testing. This one is Opus, Opus Charger, and I select a uh, discharge refresh. So in this mode, it will charge and discharge in three three times. Okay, so <coughs> kiss me. So right here is so that is uh, I believe this one is already done. I have a charge overnight. See this one have a fan and the fan try to cool it out but the fan start to getting right break and I believe that this fan will fail and then you guys going to get overheat so and I cannot leave this one in the room in my uh, bedroom I have to leave it in the bathroom so because of the noise it didn't I cannot sleep um, then you see the time right and then you see the milliamp is 700 milliamp um, so now it's try to charge back to uh, 4 volt for all 4.2 um, I believe it's already finished the cycle and there's uh, the total this number has been here for more than 10 minutes and uh, it didn't move up so that means I guess it's already fi finished okay so uh, with the Opus it will not give you a full capacity of the battery this one is 3500 milliamp you can see right here it says 3500 milliamp okay so 3291 3245 69 and 79 okay i will show you the um the uh, li little what is it called a little color okay a little color um, this is early, so I don't. I'm not turn on the light. Um, so I use the small uh, LED light instead. You can see right here. This is when I use um, what is it called? A fast test. It will show that number. You see, I lucky. I will get to three thousand three hundred ninety in the ninety in the seventy and eighty and then ninety milliamp at the end. And when I use the uh, see all of this number right right here the first mm, the where is it right here the first number okay i use the fast fast test but the second number is when i re I figured out uh do the normal test it will take longer but um let's let's try do it and i did uh bring up to 3400 over 3400 milliamp which is what 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 i want to see the result because this is an LG uh, brand battery and it should be great, right? LG is uh, is one of the top um, top brand. Okay, so then you see um, I'm sure you guys say, oh, let me see the let you want let you see the um. The result on the battery uh, uh, on the charger itself right see that is the on the battery itself right here this is uh number two number two is finished there you go the current is uh right now it stopped at 3.83 volt and the battery is ending it's get to 3435 uh, that's number two okay i show you number two the old number number two the old number is 3337 you can see it 3337 right there okay the old number when i use the fast test is 3336 uh, Okay, so the normal test right there, the normal is say no N O R, which is normal, right? Uh, normal test, and I test it at seven hundred milliamp. Five hundred milliamp, seven hundred milliamp is not 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 much. Uh, five hundred is you may get 
you may get more um, out of it. Uh, but but on a, a lot of battery, it will get to see three thousand five hundred eighteen, and some of them I believe I get a bigger number, three thousand five hundred. Uh, I got a bigger number on different battery, three thousand five hundred. Where is it? Twenty or thirty or something like that. Here, right here, two thousand five hundred thirty-six. You see, this one five oh one. This one five oh nine. Yeah, which is great. Um. It's come out a true capacity test when you use the null test and the normal test. Okay, so this one, the, let's see, this one, any other number to finish? Only number two on that one. Uh, how about this one? This one, the number two also finished. The number two, the uh, before the null test is a uh, 3369 and now 3530 mm you see and the resistance is uh, ohm resistance is 12 this one milliohm resistance is 53 but if you take it out and you put it back in it will show you less than 53 uh, okay 3030 it takes six hour 58 minutes uh, no test. I most of the, this battery, I I charge it up. Okay, so the no test is uh, what it does is it charge the battery to full charge, and then it's the uh, discharge, and then it charge back again, and it take the result. The fast test is is uh discharge, and then it's fully charge up. Uh, that's how it does. But so the norm test is the is recording a uh, more cycle from it. Uh, this one I. I uh started uh early this morning around five a.m. four fifty nine a.m. and it have not finished yet. Uh, but this one is uh randomly, some battery have uh more charge than the other, so it's uh it's it's charge faster. See this one is also finished three thousand four hundred and twelve milliamp. This one is a little bit less. Okay guys, thank you very much for viewing my video. Okay, here I also want to show you some other one that I did before and I wasn't happy about it um, because I used a fast test. Um, I thought I tried to do fast test to make it faster. Uh, at that time, I have only one uh, little color charger. <sighs> But then I buy two more from Amazon. Uh, you guys can check out the link below. I have the Amazon link that you can buy um, the little color. Uh, so here you see it's a charge. Uh, I test it two time on fast charge. It's three thousand three hundred oh six or oh one and three forty seven thirty thirty one. Okay, so you want to see the true capacity, you gotta uh, wait a little, be patient, wait a little longer and uh, choose the uh, normal test, which is a normal test. Okay, you will be happy about it. Uh, number four, number four, and see? 2530 milliamp you will be happy about it it stop it stop at 3 uh, 3.5 volt so you want to charge it up see this one stop stop at 3.7 volt so you want to charge it up to um um to get ready to use okay thank you very much for viewing my video please guys uh, like subscribe and check out the link below you guys when you click on more below the video you will uh, there's a link to um where you can buy more or all the stuff that i refer and um uh, you can uh, i uh, got a couple cents uh, from it but uh, it will help me a lot 
Uh, thank you very much, guys. Have a good day. Have a good weekend.